Hi, good evening. Hi, teacher. Hello. Hello. Good evening. I'm, I'm fine. That's good. Nice. What about you, darling? How are you? Hello, teacher. Hi. I'm, I'm fine, thank you. And you? I'm good, thank you. Are you working today as well? I don't work. I I'm a student. Oh, okay. So are you studying right now? I mean, for your career? Yes. Yeah. Um, oh. Aún no termino así. Ok. But you almost finished. Ya casi lo termine. Eh, dos semanas. Ok. And then, how, how many days are you going to have for vacation? ¿Cómo fue? <laughs> <laughs> how much time you will have for vacation? ¿Cuánto tiempo va a tener de vacación? Eh, un mes aproximadamente. That's good. We are super bien. I wish I had one month of vacation. Desearía tener un, un mes de vacación <laughs> completo. That's Rápido good. se pasa el tiempo. Yeah, I know. I know. So good evening, everybody. Good evening, Marta. Good evening, Cynthia. Hello, good evening. Good evening, coach. Good evening. How are you? I have a, I want to sleep. <laughs> I'm so tired. Uh, what time did you finish yesterday? 2.30. Uh, wow, 2.30 a.m. A.m., yes. And what time did you start today? I arrived the, to the office at uh, 10.30. A.M. Wow. So yes. it was not that early. But no, still. no, no. <laughs> but what, what time did you get up? Uh, eight o'clock. Oh I wake up. God. Yes. So yeah, you need to rest. Yes, yes, yes. But I have to do the homework and <laughs> I'm going to do today because tomorrow I will be busy too. You will be what? I'm going to be busy. Oh, you're going to be busy. Okay. Yes. And I I need more time. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> we yes. all need more time. Yes. And I want to sleep so much. <laughs> so we're going to make this hour go fast so you can go to sleep. Sorry? Do you please repeat it? Sure. We're going to make this hour go fast. Mm -hmm. Ah, yes. <laughs> uh <-huh. laughs> That's good. Hi, Oscar. Good evening. Oh, pretty good, teacher. How are you? How you doing, everyone? Good. Hi, Carolina. Good evening. Hi, teacher. Good evening. How are you? Um, I am fine. Good. That's good. <laughs> Excellent. Mm, how do you say this cancel? Uh, day off. Ah, day off. <laughs> so you have a day off today. Tuvo día libre ahora. Yes. <laughs> oh, that's good. Excellent. And what do you do? ¿Qué hizo? Mm, trabajar. <laughs> today? Descansé, pero igual trabajé. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> haciendo, haciendo tareas en la casa. <laughs> ah, ok. Ok, bien. Yeah. Ah, that's good. Pero aprovecho el tiempo. Sí, eso sí. That's good. Excelente. ¿Cómo se dice? Gracias, es thank you o thank you? Thank you. Thank you. Ah. Mm -hmm. Gracias, teacher. Sure. Teacher, may I talk to you? Sure. Yes, 
este, ayer, ¿se acuerda que le dije que me arreglaron un ratito, verdad? Sí, me quedé de hecho ahí, pero se desconectó. <risas> sí, no, lo que pasa es que de hecho se le iba a decir para que lo vieran todos. Porque ah, ok. Punto, es que me escribió alguien y me dijo que de favor me lo diera quien quiera, ¿verdad? Este, me escribió a mi, mi, mi número, como hoy aparecemos todos, ¿verdad? En, la, en el grupo. Uh -huh. Me dijo, mire, ¿qué le puede decir al teacher de que tal vez puede crear, eh, no él, pero sino que tal vez alguien se toma la libertad, me dijo, de, de crear un grupo de aparte del que ya está hecho, me dice, porque fíjate que me da pena, me dijo, preguntar, le dijo, oh, no le va a decir a nadie, me dijo, pues, me dijo, no, no, no te preocupes. Y como, ¿para qué? Le digo yo, ya ve que pues sí. La mayoría, pues todo el mundo pasa ocupado, obviamente, ¿verdad? Le dicen, oh, bueno, yo manejo mucho la red, pero porque igual te están comunicando, etcétera, etcétera. Pero le digo yo, ¿cómo para qué? Le digo, es que eso no la pena preguntar en el grupo, pues sí, pero voy a contestar ahí en la plataforma, etcétera, etcétera, porque siento que, que en la pronunciación y un montón de cosas, siento que tengo problemas. Mire, le digo yo, todos, pues. Eh, todos tenemos nuestros, nuestros líos, ¿verdad? Con, con, con esta situación. Yo sé que el teacher le lleva su orden de, de cómo le, el programa le pide. Le digo, hay cosas que pues, se quedan en el aire. Le digo, pero, pues, yo lo voy a decir ahí a los que puedan que escuchen, ¿verdad? Y si alguien se toma libertad de hacer el grupo, pues, que lo haga. Le digo, yo, yo personalmente estoy bien abierto porque no es que yo sepa todo. Obviamente, no, estamos aprendiendo todo. Pero le digo yo, sin algo, pues uno comparte algo y les ayuda. Y eso era todo lo que le hice. Ok. Sure, me, me parece. Eh, if someone wants to make a group uh, besides the ones we have, eh, sure, that's not a problem. Uh, you can join me there and I can help with any question that any of the team member has. That's not a problem. Solo que hace falta ver quién se toma la, la rienda de clase del grupo. Mm -hmm. Yeah, to just uh, anybody that wants to make it, uh, join me. I'm, I'm, I'm in. Okay. Mm -hmm. Good. Thank you, Oscar. Thank so, you. good evening, everybody. Uh, thank you very much for being here. We're going to start right now our, uh, this is our 11th class. So, today we're going to study the possessive pronouns. So let me go ahead and share here my screen with you. All right, so this is what we are going to study today, possessive pronouns, all right? So before we start, antes de comenzar, we're gonna do some hangman words. Do you remember hangman? Yeah. Recuerdan the hangman, el ahorcado? So basically it's that you tell me letters uh, from the alphabet in order to discover the word that it's in these spaces, okay? So we're gonna start with the first word. It has one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine letters. So does somebody want to start with, uh, with this word? Any letter? The letter B. Letter? Letter B. Letter B. Mm, no. Letter A. Letter A. Yes. Very good. C. What? C. Uh, let's see. C como la C. Yeah. Letter O. What? O. 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 O, no. O, no. Letter D. A. D. Okay. Uh -huh. I. Mm -hmm. e. E. 
It's adjective. Yes, very good. That's correct. That's the word, adjective. Great. <laughs> Excellent, good. Good job there. Let's go with the next one. What about this one? Letter E. E. Uh, no, there's no E. O. Letter A. O, no, A, yes. M. M? Yes. Did I put B? B. No. Yes. Letter F? No. Letter C? W. Letter C, yes. H? Yes. Yes. It's Christmas. Wow, two in a row. Good. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's correct. Christmas. Good. You're on fire, Daniela. Two in a row. Good. All right. And the last one. What about this one? It's similar to the to the to the to the old one. <laughs> um letter A. No. E. Yes. B. B. The, uh, let me remember B. because. I, okay, B. Yes. December. Oh my god! Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you got it. <laughs> yeah, December. So we are starting December. This is the first day of the month, the first day of December. So Christmas, it's around the corner. Christmas is just some days away. So do you like Christmas? Like gusta Christmas? I like Christmas. Very good. Nice. Yeah, Christmas is good. I love Christmas because of the, of the food. There's always food. Panes con pollo. Panes con chumpe. So, great. That's the best. <laughs> uh, coach? Yeah. I love uh, Christmas mm -hmm. because in this month there is the aguinaldo. <laughs> of course. Yes, definitely. <laughs> That's the best part. Aguinaldo but is... It goes yeah. go, uh, super fast. <laughs> I know. You just take it and then... You yes, just move like it. water in, exactly. in our hands. Yeah, but but Aguinaldo is coming. Definitely. Make us happy. <laughs> yeah, that makes us happy. At least for at least for one day. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> that's correct. Aguinaldo is coming. So that's one of the best part for Christmas as well. Great. So today, as I mentioned at the beginning, we're going to start. Uh, seeing the possessive pronouns. Possessive pronouns, los eh, pronombres posesivos, eh, básicamente son pronombres que utilizamos para denotar que algo le pertenece a alguien. Entonces, en este caso, de cada uno de los pronombres que tenemos para sujetos, la like de subject pronouns, es I, you, he, she, it, we, you, and they. Eh, por cada uno de ellos tenemos un possessive pronoun. Que son mine, your, his, her, its, our, eh, yours, and theirs. ¿Cómo se traduciría esto? Mine sería mío. Your sería tuyo. His suyo. Her suyo. It's suyo. Our, nuestro, yours, uh, tuyo, and theirs, theirs. Ok. 
Pachuca. Eh, creo que fue hace como dos semanas, creo, o una semana, no me recuerdo. Uh, we saw the possessive adjectives. I don't, I don't know if you remember. No sé si se recuerdan de los possessive adjectives. Yeah. ¿Cuáles eran los possessive adjectives? ¿Se recuerdan? Do you remember? Mm, What were the, the possessive? Uh, I'm sorry? On. Eh, ¿Y? ¿On? No. No. No, esos, esos eran. My. 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 Yes. Or. My. Your. Ajá. Her, his. Her. Her, his. Yo. ¿Cuál es el. el, el... El possessive adjective para he, she, and it. Him. Him. Um, Ajá. Her. Her. Para he is him. Mm -hmm. Para her, para she. Here. It's her. Her. So here, let me see. I'm, I'm, I think there's something missing here. Just let me double check here. For I is my. For I is my. Yes. Just with Y. Exactly. My. So let me check something here. I think that there's something wrong here. Just let me double check. It's similar possessive objective uh, uh, to possessive pronouns. Actually, no. That's what I'm, I want to double check something because I think there's something different. For example, with, uh, with her. Just let me check. Yeah, that's what I thought. Her, oh. is, her is hers. It's with S. Yeah. Mm-hmm. So here this is incorrect. This is the, the correct one. So for the possessive adjective, it's her. And for the possessive pronoun, pronouns. it's hers with yes. an S. Mm -hmm. Then it's, this is the same. For possessive adjective, it's the same. Then our, it's us. And theirs is them. La diferencia de los possessive adjectives era, así como lo que vimos ayer, que los adjetivos son palabras que modifican a un nombre, eh, lo, mismo pasaba con, con, lo, lo mismo pasa con los possessive adjectives. Los possessive adjectives modifican al nombre, y por eso van antes del nombre. Y podemos decir, my car, mi carro, eh, your car, tu carro. Pero si solamente decimos my, solo es mi. No It's tiene un, 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 ¿cómo se llama? un significado completo. Los possessive pronouns, sí. Porque usted puede decir, that is mine. Ese es mío. O you are pointing, for example, this. Mira. No se ve. Ahí está. Uh, the cell phone. And you say, this is mine. Para utilizar un possessive pronoun. Pero si utiliza un possessive adjective, pues decir, this is my cell phone. Este es mi teléfono. ¿Ok? ¿Se entiende la diferencia entre el possessive adjective y el possessive pronoun? ¿Cómo Richard, se utiliza? Yes. Solo una consulta. Yeah. Abajo de it sería ours. Ours. With, with S, you mean? Sí, la S, le faltaría. Yeah, exactly. Estaría... Yep, that's correct. The S. Ours is with S as well. Thank you, Ernesto. So, ¿se entiende la, la diferencia entre el possessive pronoun y el possessive adjective? ¿Y cómo se utiliza? Yes. Yes? Yes. Okay. No questions so far? 
Preguntas? No? Todo clear? Yeah. Okay. Cool. All right. So we're going to start doing some examples here. And these are the examples that we have. For example, my phone is dead. Pass mm -hmm. me yours. Mi teléfono se murió. Pasame el tuyo. Pasame el tuyo. Mm -hmm. The house of the corner is theirs. La casa de la esquina es de ellos. Don't judge a book by its cover. Esa es una, una frase bien conocida. Mm -hmm. No juzgues a un libro por su portada pasta. o mm -hmm. por su pasta. Uh -huh. So don't judge a book by its cover. Por su eh, 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 ¿Cómo se dice? Eh, por su Portada Portada, thank you And the dog is mine. mine Es mío El chucho es mío <laughs> So that's how we use the possessive pronouns So we are denotating We are um, saying That I possess something Estamos diciendo que yo poseo algo Que eso me pertenece que es mío, o es tuyo, o es de ella, es nuestro, o es de ellos. Okay? So, with that being said, um, let's do this exercise here. We have five exercises to practice. Um, en el espacio aquí que tienen al final, what you are going to write, it's a possessive pronoun, based on what it says in the sentence before. Aquí van a poner en el final de la oración un possessive pronoun eh, basado en lo que dice la oración anterior. Ok. So let me give you five minutes so you can complete these uh, sentences. Eh, una vez terminen, please let me know. Eh, si quieren, eh, le dan raise your hand ahí en su, en su Zoom para yo eh, entender quiénes ya terminaron. Thank you, Oscar.
Okay, we have one more minute. Okay, so let's check them out. Let's see number one. Hey, Oscar, can you tell me number one? I pay for my scarf, so mm -hmm. it's my. Exactly, I paid for my scarf, so <clears throat> it is, so is mine. mine. Exactly, it's me. Good. Franklin, number two. Hmm. Pick as many of these desserts. Uh, pick any of these desserts. Mm -hmm. The choice is uh, yours. Exactly. The choice is yours. yours. Pick any of these desserts. The choice is yours. La opción es tuya. Good. Thank you. Excellent. Daniela, number three. Daniela? Okay, sí, sí. Es, okay. The math books belongs to Ralph. It, it is, it is his. It is? His. His. Yes. That's correct. Very good. Excellent. Stephanie, number four. Oh my gosh. Stephanie? Uh, eso no la he completado aún. Ok. Permita. A ver. All my brothers love video games. Playing the the is a favorite pastime. 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 Past time of theirs. Theirs, exactly. Very good. Theirs. Good. Okay. And Cynthia, number five. We bought this game together, so it is ours. Very good. So it is ours. Excellent. Very good. Thank you, Cynthia. So that's basically how we use the 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 the, the, the possessive pronouns, uh, always notating that something belongs to us. Okay. So this is a question that we can use using the possessive pronouns. It is whose jacket is this? Whose it means the quien. So whose jacket is this? The quien is esta chaqueta. And then you can answer either it's mine or it's his, it's hers, it's its, it's ours. Or you can say this way, lo pueden decir de esta forma, eh, poniéndole un apóstrofo y una S al nombre, eso denota que es posesivo. Exacto. The, the contracted form. Um, no necessarily, because on this form, we're saying that cuando le agregamos la S, la, la apostrofe y la S, denota que es de su propiedad, del nombre que le estamos poniendo el apostrofe y el S. Entonces, en este caso, en vez de decir it's his, decimos it's Tom's. Es de Tom's. Mm -hmm. So, if, for example, we can say uh, this is a Martha's car. Este es el auto de Marta. Y lo que hacemos es agregarle el, el apóstrofo y la S. So Mar Marta's car. All right. Entonces es otra forma en la cual nosotros podemos denotar posesión eh, agregándole un apóstrofo y una S a la par del, eh, del nombre. Entonces, Chair, cuando... I have a question. Yes, tell me. Uh, uh, it's mine is porque es mío. Exactly. Y it's Tom's es otra persona o, o se refiere a que yo me llamo Tom. No. Eh, Tom's. Cuando es, exactly. Se refiere a otra persona. 
Okay. Okay. Sí. Thanks. You're welcome. <coughs> Entonces, ahí lo que estamos diciendo es que es de tal persona. Estamos en un grupo de nosotros, por ejemplo, de decir en una clase, y alguien me pregunta, whose jacket is this? No es mío, entonces es de Oscar. Entonces voy a decir, it's Oscars. Ok, ok. So, eh, esta pregunta, whose jacket is this? O whose, como tal, eh, significa de quién es. Y nos va a ayudar para después nosotros poder contestar con un possessive pronoun. All right. So, we're going to uh, check a conversation here. And let me check this with... Uh, let me see. Um, Martha. So, you're going to be letter A. I'll be letter B. Okay. Is this your jacket? No, that's not mine. Whose is it? Whose is it? Whose, Whose is, is it? Whose is it? Uh, maybe it is Tom's jacket. No, that is jackets over there. Uh, I'm not sure then. Uh, it is Beth jacket. Is it? Is it Beth jacket? No. It's too big to be her jacket. Well, uh, it belongs to someone. Very good. So as you see here, uh, he is using mine and it's using uh, the el, el nombre con apóstrofo y una S para denotar la posesión, en este caso, de la chaqueta. All right. So what we're going to do it right now, it's uh, we're going to make groups so you can practice the conversation. Y lo que quiero que hagan es de que eh, en vez de solamente decir jacket, una vez hayan practicado con jacket, pueden utilizar alguno de los, de las, del vocabulario de clothes que les mandé ayer en el grupo eh, para cambiarlo en, por, en vez de jacket, puede ser pants, puede ser trousers, puede ser sweater, socks, eh, cualquiera del vocabulario que vimos ayer, lo pueden utilizar y cambiarlo en la conversación. ¿Ok? Uh, teacher, yes. please, uh, could you send this uh, image to the WhatsApp, please? Sure. Okay, thank you. Let me send it. Just let me open my WhatsApp here and I'll send it right now. Okay, I'm going to make the groups right now and then I'll send you the picture in WhatsApp. Okay. Okay. All right. So please join to the groups and I'll send you the picture right now. Eh, Marta se puede unir. 
Uh, no, I don't know. I don't know how. Eh, no le salió ahí la, la, la opción de, de unirse. No, no, no. Déjenme moverlo otra vez para ver si le sale. Ahora. Let me try. Ok, wait. Aquí está. Ralson se pudo unir a la a las a los grupos. Okay, I think he's not there. A ver, estamos en. Ok, si quieres, empieza otra vez. Que nos perdimos un poco. Espera, espera. Ok. Quiero ver. Tenemos que, tengo que buscar la imagen esta de la conversación, ¿verdad? Oh, sí. Eh. Eh, yo la acabo de mandar ahí al, al grupo de, okay. de WhatsApp. ¿Es this your jacket? Yes, ¿Es eso? Ah, okay. Sí. Mm -hmm. Okay. Um, you're gonna, you are gonna be the letter E, and you gonna be the letter B, okay? The letter A. A letter A and B. Okay. Is this your jacket? Come on, Nelson. Uh, Oh, that's not me. It's not mine. 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 But, uh, not, not mine. No, that's that's no mine. Who is it? Whose is it? Maybe is it Tom's jacket? No, that is that is his jacket over there. I know, sure, Tim. It, is it Beth's jacket? No, it is to be to be her jacket. Hola. No, it is to be to be her jacket. Well, it belongs to someone. Very good. Okay. Now um, I'm going to be the letter B. Okay. Okay, Nelson, you start. Okay. Uh, is, it is your jacket? Is this? No. It is no. your jacket. Is this your jacket? No, it that's is. not mine. Who is, is it? Maybe it is Tom's jacket. No, that is it his jacket over there. I'm sure I'm now uh, I'm now sure then. It is bad jacket. Bad no. jacket. No, it is too big to be her jacket. Well, it belongs to someone. To someone. Okay. Very good. Now it's with Jorge. Okay. Um, I start. Is this your jacket? Is it your jacket? No, it is to be to be her jacket. Well. It belongs to someone. Okay. Okay. Entonces, eh, ahora usted, eh, ¿cómo hacemos ahora acá? Veamos. 
Y ahí hicimos... Cambiémoslo por otra. Ah, cambiemos por los nombres. Ajá, correcto. Ah, y también la, la prenda y el nombre. Podemos utilizar uno de los de ustedes, por ejemplo. Eh, si gusta, inicio yo. Este, pero, ¿qué, ¿qué prenda pudiera ser? En este caso, um, T-shirt. Camiseta, pudiera ser. Yeah. A sweater, is too. Uh -huh. Is this your T-shirt? Espérame, espérame, espérame. ¿Lo comienzo o caro? Uh, si gusta, usted. Ok. Yeah. Eh, empiezo con el A, usted con el B. Is Bye. this your t-shirt? No, that's not mine. Who it is? Maybe it is. Ah, ponga Franklin's el nombre de ella. Jack, ah, Franklin. Franklin's Franklin t-shirt. Uh -huh. Franklin's t-shirt, yeah. Okay. No, that is a t-shirt over there. I am not sure then. It is uh, Carolina's uh, t-shirt? No, it is to be, to be her shirt. T-shirt. <laughs> well, it belongs to someone. Okay. <laughs> bah, hoy, si gusta, eh, hágalo usted con, con Caro. Caro y Darling, hagan ustedes otra hora. Eh, no sé si vamos sobre t-shirt o sobre otra, no sé, otra prenda. O vamos continuo. a ver. Solo que el jacket es mío, entonces de, deben de utilizar Franklin's jacket. Ajá. Uh -huh. ¿Ustedes te parece? Uh -huh. ah, si gusta, empiecen ustedes A y B. <risas> o sea, siempre lo hacemos con jacket. Eh, no, t-shirt o no sé. Shirt. O short, ajá, ahí ustedes deciden. Caro está ahí. Caro está ahí. Sí, aquí estoy, aquí estoy. Short o t-shirt o son glasses o cual, ¿qué que podemos utilizar? Vivo, ¿qué Ajá, recuérdelo bien, esta Navidad Movie está trayendo todos los días para que se le diga. Hi, teacher. Hello. Hi. Uh, jeans podría ser jeans yes mm -hmm, jeans bueno ok uh, and, and no. mm -hmm. uh, is this your jeans no that's not mine is it Maybe it is Tom Jeans. Jeans. No, that is his jacket. Perdón. No, that is his jeans over there. I am not sure them. Is it bad jeans? No, it is too big to be hard jeans. Well, it belongs to someone. Sí. Ronald? I am A or B. B? Okay. And I A? It is your, your jeans? No, that's not mine. Is it? Maybe it is Tom Jeans. No, that, that is his jeans over there. I'm not sure then. Is, is it bad jeans? No, it is to be to be her jeans. Well, it belongs to someone. Okay. Uh, I am with Daniela. Yes. Um, letter A or B. Shorts. Uh, eh, usted va acá. ¿Más quedamos dónde? 
no, it is to. Uh, no, it is to be to wear hair swimming shorts. Where is belong to Sawe? Can you say it again, David? Ah, el teacher. Teacher, ¿cómo se dice? Someone. Ay, la última eh, palabra es someone. 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 Ajá, sí, ese es. Ajá, someone. 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 Como, entiendo, one. Ajá. Someone. Como decir el número uno y primero ah. some. Some. Así, S-O-M. Ah, sí. Someone. Someone. Ajá. Someone. Ah. Y... I am no sure thing, no. Ah, I, I not, no, it's I'm not sure then. Creo que ahí, ah. ahí me equivoqué, es, ahí puse I'm noun, pero es I not. I'm not sure then. So, I uh, not, ah, uh, uh -huh. ok. Entonces I not sure, I, no es I am, sino que es I not. Es am, I'm not. I'm not. Uh -huh. ah, I'm, I'm not, not sure then. Ah, ok. Otra palabra. No, solo eso. Ah, okay. pues. Is this your slippers? Slippers, is it a plural? So, si es plural, ¿cómo sería, la, ¿cómo sería la pregunta si son slippers? Is. No. Is. No, they are yours. No, si, es, no. si es plural, el verbo to be, ¿cuál utilizamos? You are. You are. Entonces sería are. You are. Are this. Are they. Are this. Are. Are this. Are this your sleeper? No, yeah. no your, no, ¿verdad? Yeah, yeah. Sí. Yeah. 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 Are there your sleepers? No, are this. Are this. Oh, okay. uh -huh. Are these your slippers? Good. No, that's not mine. Who is it? Maybe it is Tom's slippers. No, that is his slippers over there. I'm not sure, Tom. Is it Beth's slippers? Bed no. slippers. Okay. No, it is too big to be here. Slippers. Well, it belongs to someone. Very good. Someone. Someone. Yes. Someone. Yeah. Very good. All right. So we're gonna go back to the main uh, uh, room. So let me go ahead and. Send you back. Okay. All right, let's wait for rest to come back. Really? They... So, because I, I sent Catherine and Relson, I think. Yes. No. But it don't matter. Uh, the conversation was so funny. Okay. Oh, That's good. Yeah. <laughs> I, I, I guess like to... we, was, we was waiting for them. All right. That's good. I... I like to tell her. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> That's good. That's good. That, if you practice, that was excellent. So no worries. Yes. Una pregunta. Yes. ¿Cuándo usar no y cuándo usar not? Porque eh, en la conversación que usted nos manda para practicar, dice no, that's not mine. Entonces, ¿cuándo suele usar no o cuándo usar not? 
Déjenme ver. No. No, that's. En el B. No, that's not mine. Uh -huh. eh, en sí no hay una, una fórmula para decir cuándo puede utilizar not y cuándo sí, pero en este caso es por el tipo de pregunta que se hace. Como la primera es una pregunta, una yes, no question. Entonces, la respuesta que tiene que ser al principio siempre va a ser yes or no. Entonces, cuando ya utilizamos el not, es siempre cuando va después del verbo to be. En este caso, como está utilizando no, that is not mine. Porque está contractado aquí el that's. Uh -huh. Entonces, si va después del, del, del verbo to be, entonces, o de algún verbo auxiliar, por ejemplo, does not, did not, have not. Entonces, ahí sí podemos utilizar el not. Pero cuando tenemos la respuesta de una yes, no question, solo utilizamos no. Oh, yes. Gracias, teacher. You're welcome. Do you have any questions in regards to the conversation? Any new word that you, you didn't know? Alguna palabra que no sabían? Any new vocabulary? Yes? No? No. All right. Very good. So let's continue then with the possessive pronouns. So let me share here. So we have here this uh, this uh, sentences where we are going to be using the the the, the possessive pronouns, and because of the time, we're going to use them, uh, or we're going to make them right now here with all of you. So uh, I'm just going to be saying one name, and you're going to be doing each of them. All right. So let's start here. Daniela, can you do number one? Daniela, you there? Sorry. Um, uh, the expensive are, are you? Uh, we're using possessive pronouns. Sure. What is the possessive pronouns that you? Uh, you. Me equivoco. Your. Yours. Your, uh, sorry. So is it yours? Yours. All the yes to that. Yeah, yours. Yours. Sorry. Okay. All right. So can you say it again? These pencils. These pencils are yours. Very good. Excellent. Maria, number two. Okay, the blue ball is mine. Excellent. Uh, Franklin, number three. Franklin? The, the blue car is ours. Very good. Excellent. Yeah. Okay. Darling, number four. That diamond ring is her? Hers. Hers. Mm -hmm. Yes. Nelson, number five. He meet the famous singer Paul and Jane last night his house in his there. There's. Mm -hmm. There you go. Excellent. Thank you. Ronald, number six. The luggage and the luggage is luggage. 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 Mm -hmm. The luggage on the counter is his. His. Very good. Thanks. Excellent. Jorge. The pictures on the wall near on the wall near the pillar are uh, hers. Very good. Cynthia. Eight. Yep. 
in our garden in the summer house is a bird. The nest is its. Excellent. Oscar. Right? Yeah, nine. The smelly good for nothing cat is ours. Very good. Excellent. And Stephanie. Honestly, this was not my fault. It was yours. Excellent. Very good. Great. That's good. And the last thing we're going to do it's I'm going to be showing sentences and you will be uh, using the possessive pronoun. So anybody that wants to say the answer, just say it out loud. Teacher. Yes. Smelly is like a apestoso. Yep. Wow. So is is the apestoso bueno para nada? I know. Gato, it's mine. <laughs> yeah, the Oscar, person who Oscar, the... Uh -huh. Oscar was seeing you. Oh. Why was you laughing? <laughs> you feel like you might be get as smelly. Yeah, no. <laughs> no, I, I don't know why they say it that way, but yeah, I think they hate the cat. <laughs> All right, so we have this sentence. I have a dog. The dog is? Mine. Exactly. That dog is mine. Mine. Yeah. Next. Any volunteer? Me. There you go. They have, they have a bike. Uh -huh. The bike is there. There. Exactly. There. Okay. She has. Uh -huh. His cat's a cat. Mm -hmm. That cat is her. That cat is? Hers. Hers. Excellent. Very good. What about this one? He has a key. That key. key. key? A key. Ah, sorry. Huh? He has a key. That key is hers. It's hers? His. His. Exactly. That key is his. Oh, yes. <laughs> what about this one? We have a car. That car is ours. 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 That's correct, very good. So uh, that's basically how we use the possessive pronouns. Um, remember, it's always to talk about uh, possession. It's always about to talk, uh, to, to always talk about uh, things that belongs to us. So, and we can use them as a pronoun. Las podemos utilizar como pronombres, por sí solos, sin necesidad de poner un nombre a la par. Si ponemos un nombre a la par, entonces ya no es un possessive pronoun, sino que tiene que ser un possessive adjective. Okay? And just for we can practice the last time, the pronunciation uh, for each of those words, I need you to repeat them after me. So you can make sure that you are uh, repeating the, and pronouncing them the correct way. Okay? So the first one is mine. Repeat after me, mine. 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 Then yours. 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 Right. yours. Make sure to, to make the sound of the S at the end. Yours. Yours. Then his. 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 Then hers. 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 It's. 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 Ours. 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 And then yours again. 
Yours. And theirs. Yours. Theirs. 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 Excellent. Very good. So, uh, that was the class for today in regards to possessive pronouns. And I don't know if you have any questions uh, so far in regard to possessive pronouns. Algo que no les haya quedado claro. Algo que you need to, or something that you, you need that I repeat it again. Let me know. Todo, todo blue. Todo claro. Questions? Oh, okay. Everything good? okay. Everything okay. Okay. Good. Any new vocabulary? Something? No? Yeah. Yes. Sure. Yes. Yes. He visto una cosa. It se mantiene possessive pronoun y possessive adjective. Correct. No cambia. That's correct. Yes, that's correct. No cambia. Tanto como para possessive adjective como para possessive pronoun. Va igual, it's. Good. Any other question? No? No. Okay, very good. So then that was the class for today. Uh, if you have any, ah, remember, and that's something that it was uh, also posted on the WhatsApp group to do the exercise of the platform. Hagan los ejercicios de la plataforma eh, lo más pronto posible, ya que la otra semana es la última semana de clases. Entonces, las, los ejercicios tienen que estar completados para antes de la, del último día de clases para que usted pueda descargar su diploma y obtener el certificado. ¿Ok? okay. Y, y ahí terminamos. Okay. ¿Ya no vamos okay. a seguir o okay, qué, teacher? Uh, no, eh, según lo que dijeron, ahí creo que la próxima semana igual les van a mandar como la información para inscribirse al siguiente módulo y ahí les van a dar fechas. Yo creo que las fechas serían maybe for next year, porque no creo que vayan a abrir grupos ahorita ya que, que ya son las, 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 las fechas festivas. Uh -huh. Seguiríamos con usted, teacher. Eh, not sure, no estoy seguro. Okay. Eh, ajá, porque no sé cómo. ¿Cómo no? Por eso es lo que le estaba sí, diciendo yo desde el principio, lo de, la, lo de la muchacha que me dijo de que se hacían un grupo aparte, porque de repente ya la comodidad del grupo sería bien sano a veces preguntar entre los que ya, ya se conocen, lo que les, como no están todos conectados, por eso no, no, no todos escucharon, ¿verdad? Pero no sería malo como una tools. Ya. Yeah. I mean, it's fine. Uh, como les dije al principio, está bien. Si ustedes quieren hacer un grupo aparte, that's good. Uh, me pueden agregar ahí. And I'm going to be there. Yo les puedo ayudar en whenever you need. So just add me to the group. Alguien right. que lo haga, porque sería bueno para pues, ayudarnos todos. Yes. Yep. That's correct. So you just let me know. Y me agregan ahí. Y, and I'm in. Okay. All right. So okay. thank you very much. Have a good night. Uh, and we're going to see you tomorrow. Okay. Okay. Good night, everybody. Good night, good night, teacher. Good night. Good night. Bye. Bye. Take teacher. care. Good night. Take care. Bye-bye.